The World Health Organization, the WHO, considers mental health as a state of mental well-being that enables people to cope with the stress of life, realizing their abilities, learn and work well, and contribute to their community. It is an integral component of health and well-being that underpins the individual and collective abilities to make decisions and build relationships. However, mental health has been classified as a basic human right which transcends beyond just the absence of mental disorders. It is in this light that a clinical psychologist and a senior lecturer at the University of Cape Coast, Dr. Charlotte Omane Kwachin is advocating for the provision of socioeconomic framework to ensure access to these rights as Ghana joins the world in celebration of Mental Health Day 2023. She said Ghana has one of the best legal framework on mental health, the Mental Health Act, which according to her, has been touted as one of the best mental health laws globally by the WHO and other institutions. She notes that what the country needs is creating access and ensuring that the socioeconomic foundations are established to ensure that people have right in various institutions to accommodate them if they have mental health challenges. And one of the ways of defining a person with mental illness is that on on any part, on any part, meaning that he, you know, in a uh, to be an adult, you have to be someone who is in full mental health and is able to contribute to society. This year's World Health Mental Health Day is on the theme, Mental Health is a Universal Human Right to Improve Knowledge, raise awareness and drive actions that promote and protect everyone's mental health as a universal human right. Dr. Kwachin Yaku said, as individuals, we owe it to ourselves to protect our own mental health through healthy eating, enough exercise, clean environment, avoid excessive thinking, stress, among other healthy activities. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.